Hello again, everybody. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. From the North Pole of Batangas. I had a request to uh, sit by the Christmas tree. Give you all some Christmas spirit. So, uh, hope there's not too much sun here because I'm by the window. But I'll try to get a good angle. Anyway, this is it. Uh, Grace and Catherine just went to some kid's birthday party. They're always going somewhere. Trying to keep Catherine occupied is tough. And I'm waiting on uh, one of the neighbors here. He's going to look at my scooter. Just making a little bit of a noise coming from the back. I don't know. It's probably something minor. He's a he's a mechanic. He built his own motorcycle, and uh, he's just a neighbor. Helps us out once once in a while. So I figured I'd just give him give him take a look at it, see what he finds. Maybe it just needs some kind of fluid or I don't know. It runs fine. It rides fine. Just makes a little bit of a noise. And uh, what else? So we talked to Dingalan, and the refrigerator and the freezers does cool down, does get cold. But the fan in the small refrigerator we have had a long time is not spinning. So somebody has to look at the fan. And the big refrigerator that we never even used, the big beverage cooler, tall one. It was brand new, never used. Uh, all the glass broke out of it, but the motor's working. It does get cold. They just said, uh, just the glass has to be replaced. It has to be uh, made by like a window maker. Somebody specializes in glass. Can, it can be fixed. But the flood broke all the glass. But that uh, does still work, still runs. If anybody knows a cheaper way to fix it, let me know in the comments section. Um, what else? We told them to uh, make sure they fix anything that really, really needs to be fixed, necessary, before we get there. The beginning of the year uh, maybe that's better I don't know the sun's really coming in behind me uh, let me move a little bit now I've just seen the Christmas tree here yeah anything that really needs to be repaired like they can't wait um, like I told the doors, like the bedroom doors and any kind of doors that need to be closed. We need to have those fixed, especially the bedroom, living room door to the main house, the two apartments. Make sure they're working. They don't have to lock. They just have to close so there's no bugs coming in. Luckily, the uh, screens and the windows, none of that was broken. And... Uh, that's about it. There's not a lot we can do before we get there. It's just hard. It's just hard communicating with them and getting things done. And uh, I keep sending them money. I'm constantly running out here. So I really can't do a lot till I get there and know what I have to spend, what I actually have to really, really uh What's necessary? I know for sure once I get there I'm going to want the uh, water pump working so we have uh, normal showers and stuff because without the water pump working you have to uh, just use the uh, hand pump you got to fill up buckets and that's how you take a bath or shower and that's also how you flush toilets fill up buckets of water so it's a real pain in the neck and I'm not going to like it too much. 
So, that's going to be a main issue. But I told them wait till we get there because I don't know where they're going to put it. Uh, they have to put it in a location where maybe it's not going to get flooded next time and it's not going to get broken. So, that's just one more thing. One more issue. Um, I did chat with Adam. He is going to have the New Year's Eve party. He said, yeah, that's an annual thing. He's not going to, he's not going to cancel it. So, that's probably the plan. We will go there uh, before New Year's Eve. And then we will get to Dingaland probably on the first so, that's something to look forward to, I guess. Or not. And we're still trying to get Myrna to come here soon. But uh, she kind of has plans on just waiting until right before we leave to come here. I don't know why. She doesn't want to come here early and save some money. So we figured out she's paying like 83 pesos a day to live where she's living. We told her the sooner she comes here, the more she can save. But she wasn't really interested in that idea. Maybe she thinks if she comes here earlier, Grace will put her to work. And also Catherine sometimes doesn't leave her alone. Maybe she doesn't want to be bothered. I don't know. Anyway, that's her life. So her decision. We just talked to her today. She just left. And I said, okay, it's up to you. When do you want to come here? So as of right now, she's not here yet. So that's about it. I'm here by myself for I don't know how many hours. I'll be at the birthday party. That's why I'm doing this video now. Uh, nothing else to tell you. Just kind of waiting for uh, the neighbor. We call him Police. That's his nickname. I don't know why. To take a look at my scooter. Maybe I'll do a quick video of him if he's if he works on it. See what he figures out. But uh, I don't know. Maybe we'll see. So that's about it right now. Nothing else to really talk about. Hope you're all having a good day out there. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, make sure to leave them in the comments section. And subscribe. If you haven't already, I appreciate it. Do me a Christmas favor and subscribe. How can you turn down Santa Claus? Hit that button. It's red, just like this. Take care of yourself, your friends, your family. That's going to do it. God bless everyone. Take care. Peach, come out.